Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I just came off a really long weekend and that's great because it gave me some time to kind of go through some of my products that I've been using and toss out the ones that are getting ready to expire so I could replace them. Yeah, right, more money. But also at the same time, it occurred to me and I've been asked this question a couple of times lately, what skincare products are actually some of my favorites that I've tested that are still in my skincare routine because I test a lot of products. I promise you one of these days I will do a loop-de-loop -loop around my office or studio where I film these videos and you will see boxes and boxes of skincare that gets sent to me to review. Love it, it's amazing, but it's a lot. Maybe I need to do a giveaway on some of that skincare. So there are definitely a lot of skincare products that end up on my bathroom shelf that don't get used after I test them because a vitamin C serum, basically the ingredients are the same. You guys know my credo on this channel. It's more about ingredients and effectiveness over brand name and price. So for the most part, certain types of skincare products are just kind of the same, but there are a few that I have tested out this year that have managed to become sort of my favorite or a staple in my skincare routine when I'm not testing other products like them. Now, if you happen to be new to my channel today and not familiar with who I am, I'm Chris Gibson, a skincare expert, been doing this for 30, five years, yeah, it's a really long time, and my job is to help you find skincare that will work for you, not into your wallet, and not do you more harm than good. So if this is your first time, you picked the right video to watch today. The first product I'm gonna to talk to you guys about, I have reviewed and talked about on the channel before, and it's Malin and Getz, and this is a facial cleanser that turns into an oxygenating mask, and it contains stabilized vitamin C for a skin brightening punch when you use it. Now this is not a skin cleanser you would use every single day. I use it a couple of times a week, but I can tell you it makes a huge difference in the look of my skin and it lasts all day. Again, it's an oxygenating gel. It's a detox mask, but it also works as your facial cleanser when you use it for that step. Now, of course, I will list this product down below in the video description box so you can check it out later along with the others that I'm gonna be talking to you you about today. The next skincare product that I'm going to talk about really surprised me and this is Faded Topicals and it is a skin brightening, lightening for age spots, hyperpigmentation areas. So it is a fading serum. Now you can use this on your face and you can use it on your hands which is where I use it. I will tell you it does not have the best smell. It sort of smells like when people get their hair permed but that doesn't last very long. It does fade and it's a great formulation because it has tranexamic acid, kojic acid, and niacinamide, which helps it work very well on skin brightening very quickly. So if you have dark age spots on the backs of your hands, areas on your face, I use it around my temples where we guys tend to get most of our sun damage and it really has made a big difference. It's relatively inexpensive, especially for what it does. So this has become something that I do daily in my skincare routine. And speaking of skincare serums, I have been traveling a lot this summer and I have to tell you, thank God that somebody came up with these multitasking serums. Now, multitasking serums are serums that combine several skincare steps if you will, and ingredients into one product like vitamin C serum, niacinamide, glycolic acid, sometimes lactic acid. Also, some of them have stabilized retinol or retinaldehyde in the serum so it can be used both day and night as long as you use sunscreen. Now, I have tested these type of serums all the way from JLo to U Beauty to the one I'm gonna to talk to you about today, which is Cure. I have reviewed this product on the channel before. This is from the skincare company that makes the Cure Red Light Therapy Mask, something that I've also reviewed here on the channel. I will link to those as well below in the video description box if you're interested in red light therapy masks. But this particular product contains vitamin C, glycolic acid, stabilized retinol. It is not irritating, absorbs well, and saves me from having to take four or five different skincare products with me when I travel. So it's a really great product. Again, saving you some time and some money. I still like applying all my different products when I'm home and have time to do that. But man, I gotta tell you, when you're short on time or you gotta go somewhere, this is the type of product you wanna have in your skincare routine. And speaking of retinol, most of you who follow me know that I'm a big believer in using retinol serums. They're the most powerful topical serum we have for anti-aging all the way from tretinoin, which is prescription strength Retin-A, to the over-the-counter retinols and retinol-dehydes. Now I have a whole 
set of videos on retinol and how to use them, but basically they're going to help your face, the backs of your hands, the tops of your arms, anywhere that's been exposed to the sun over the years. And if you're in your fifties, like I am, you, even with sunscreen, you're going to have some sun damage. It can actually help reverse a lot of that. If you're very consistent in using it, the problem is when you go to apply it to other areas of the body, besides the face, it can often be too irritating because these formulations are stronger. Well, the company Versed, which is a relatively new skincare company has come out with a press restart retinol body lotion. This is encapsulated retinol that you can use everywhere. They have also balanced this formulation out with hydrating shea butter. It is just an excellent, excellent product. And it's been so needed to have something we could use on other areas of the body to get that beneficial effect of retinol without the potential risk of irritation. And another product by Versed, which I have really fallen in love with, and this surprised me, was their mineral sunscreen. Now this is a broad spectrum, 35 mineral sunscreen that works extremely well for the face, neck, ears, backs of the hands. Again, anything that's exposed to the sun, you wouldn't want to use this as a body sunscreen because it's not that much of it in the tube. However, it is slightly tinted so that it does not appear white or shiny. It just absorbs completely into the skin. One of the best formulations of mineral sunscreens that I've come across in a very long time. And believe me, if you've been with me anytime, you know I have reviewed, oh my God, tons of sunscreen. So if you've been looking for something that's light, that's gonna give you plenty of protection. 35 is really all you need. It's not gonna irritate or burn your eyes and not look shiny and make you look pasty. No matter your skin tone, this is definitely a product to check out. So these are some of my all-time favorite skincare products that have stayed in my skincare routine. Of course, I have many, many others, and I will do some more videos on those, but these right here are the ones this year that really surprised me when I reviewed them, kind of exceeded my expectations on what I would think what happened with them. Well formulated, cruelty free, sustainable, all the things that you guys like, and they're all relatively inexpensive, which right now we all need that. And for even more exceptional ways to roll back the clock on skin aging, be sure to check out this video that's coming up next. Thank you guys for watching and supporting the channel. You know how much I really appreciate it. Stay beautiful, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you all over on that next video.